What's going on guys? It's Scoot Players back here with another Pokemon Sword video. And today we're gonna be going we're gonna be doing some more Pokemon Sword. And last video we got the Pokedex. And today I don't know what's gonna happen today guys, but we're gonna find out. But firstly I wanna get so I showed you guys that last video. I got my buddy S Dragon to level 9 and what I need to do is that I need him to level up quickly so I might just go do that right now and basically last time we I found a Lulu and it gave me lots of experience so seriously there's a Lulu right there I'm coming for you Dragon. And I recently just started watching Pokemon Journeys, which is basically like a thing as Pokemon Sword, which is really cool. Alright, so what should I use? How about Pink Attack? I should do. Oh, that's not very good. Happy, seriously. I'm gonna try Ember. I think that Ember will do something better. Yeah, that's better. A critical hit, wow. Wildly fainted. Bye bye, kitty. Nice, and he leveled up. That was pretty cool. How about we get him to level 11? Oh, I did. Seriously, I just ran into that. Is that thing again? Yes, scroll that, scroll that. I don't know how to pronounce it, but I'll just put scroll that for now. Fat cheeks. <laughs> look at him, he's got fat cheeks. <laughs> That's so funny. Let me just try and kill this. Hell yeah. Don't kill me. Heart oh, fine. It just blows my defense. That's not good. I'm uh, pleased to be pretty good at I'm trying to guard right now. No, I didn't do that. Tackle. Okay. Well, that's not bad. Oh yeah, and I also gave Score Bunny this thing called an Auron Berry, and I hear that it can heal up your Pokemon when it's in a bit of a pinch in battle. And that's why I went to my bag, and then I, and then when I pressed the Auron Berry, it just said give to a Pokemon, and then I was like, how, how do I do that? And then, yeah, so then I just gave it to... Wall bunny, and then just now that's how it works. So yeah, let's just get on with it. Where do we go next? Hmm. Oh, let's hop. Hey, hop. This Mickey has been thinking. If you're a Pokemon trainer now, you must want to try a gym challenge. A gym challenge. What's that? A gym challenge, mate. I thought it was just a gym leader or something, but whatever. The annual competition where trains can battle it out for the right to challenge the champion. But the trick is, you've got to be endorsed if you want to take power. What? What does... Wait, I don't even know what endorsed means. <laughs> and lead them seem to think I'm up to snuff the old stuff. So I'm thinking I ought to talk to the professor and see if she can help. What professor? Sonia? That professor Sonia person. You've got to take part too. A proper rival is just the thing every trainer needs to keep growing stronger after all. It keeps you motivated, right? The professor's heart is way down at the end of round two, so let's head then and give our teams the chance to train up a bit along the way. Yeah, right now I've only just got School Bunny, aka okay, S Dragon. But you, you, is there going to be a route three after this? My god, this thing goes on forever. Oh, what's this shiny thing? Uh, oh. oh, revive. What's that? A medicine that can be used to revive a single Pokemon that has fainted. It also restores half of the Pokemon's max HP. That's pretty cool. Down the stairs. Those are steep stairs. Not too. Oh, over here, Kitas. Alright, he says it's time we filled in our teams a bit. Hey, what are you doing? And I'm here to teach you how. You need to catch Pokemon if you've got any hope of filling in that Pokedex. Lee, where'd you come from? I don't, I don't know. He just appeared. 
Every Pokemon has got a type or two, which can make it good against some opponents, but poor against others. That's the reason you want to catch different Pokemon to cover one another's weaknesses. Now, let's all have a champion time as I show you how it's done. Alright. Oh, we just found it. Did I just find... What? How do you go Rickety? He has a... What's a Rickety? Rickety. Yeah, my controller needs to do that. Oh. Oh, it's just a... Is Leon the NPC or something? Pokeball. He has 50 Pokeballs! It's so good, yes. 50 Pokeballs. Nice dash in there, not bad. Yeah. One, two... I'm gonna go out. Oh my god. He actually caught it. I thought they were supposed to weaken a Pokemon or something. They're fine. Look at he just disappeared. Typical Dave. I'll give you some more Pokeballs and I'll give you some more Pokeballs. In turn, I'll only ask that you can catch plenty of Pokemon. The Pokemon around here seem easy to catch. It looks like they're itching to join some trainers team, wouldn't you say? Yeah, sure. 20 Pokeballs, thanks. The Pokemon on your team will get EXP points when you catch Pokemon too. I know that. And of course I get XP points from the battle, so take on the other trainers you need along the path to help your Pokemon thrive. Your team will keep on changing and growing as you get stronger together, no doubt. But I even, but even I don't, don't know exactly how yet. Show your champion something good, alright? Alright, sure. Hi. Alright, I'm gonna catch loads of Pokemon, the professor will be shocked when she sees. Alright, but I'll get more than you. I'll fill out the whole of my Pokedex. What oh, is Pokemon? Why well, is there an exclamation mark in the grass? Uh, which one should I catch? Uh, Alright. What? What? What's that? Oh, a Hootoot! I don't think I'm gonna catch this thing. I don't want to catch this. I'm just gonna run. Bye. Hello, Hootie. Oh, what's that? A cheese Sure, I'll check. I'll catch that. I'll catch that for sure. I mean, I'll need a water type, fire type, and everything. So I go to my bag, right? And then I go to Pokeball and then use it. Wait, how do I have 25 Pokeballs when I when the one just came with 20? That's good. One shake, two shake, three shakes. And caught it! Yes, Peter was caught. I wonder what type this is. Oh, he almost leveled up, score bunny. That's, oh, Peter's data will be added to the Pokedex. The water type, the snapping Pokemon, a num the num number 42. Height is one. Yeah, I'm not gonna read that stuff. Apparently, the each of its teeth and impels it to snap its jaws at anything in front of it. That's kind of mean. Uh, yeah, sure. I'll call him Sea Dragon. Sea. Uh. Sea Dragon. There we go, Sea Dragon. That's cool, we just got a new member, guys. Wait, what's that thing lunging about? What's that? What's that thing? A wild thing it is. What is that? What's it called? Let me see. Zig. 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 Uh, zig zag. Zig zag goon? Zig zag goon. Zig zag goon. Okay, I think that's kind of set. But this thing's cool. This thing's cool, so yeah, I'm probably going to catch it. Uh, it. Oh yeah, that's how I was by. What's this? A Pokemon? Oh yeah, yeah, those are the wrong guys I got. And yeah, I'll use a Pokeball on this guy. Oh, uh, Zig Zagoon. I don't know how to pronounce it. Oh, yep, I'm gonna catch it. I'm gonna catch it. 
Yes. Nice. And he leveled up. Nice. That's Dragon Man is now level 11. 21 years old. Six degrees data will be added to the Pokedex. To dark and normal type. Wait a sec. I've heard of that name Zigzagoon before. But this isn't a normal Zigzagoon. Why does it say Gal Galari Galeri Galarian form? Did they just add a a Galarian form of Zigzagoon? That's a dark and normal type? Like the normal Zigzagoon is a normal type. But yeah, that's pretty cool. It's re it's restless. Nurse has it constantly running around. If it sees another Pokemon, it will purposely run into them in order to start a fight. That's why it probably ran into me. Yeah, I'll call on Z Dragon now. We got Z Dragon. We got C Dragon. Call and now it's gonna be and C Dragon. So we so we're just about to get us our third member, I think. Z Dragon. Nice. Z Dragon, sorry. Z, I don't know. Mm -hmm. oh. oh, it's a Pokemon trainer. Hmm. Oh. I'm going to talk to him. Hey, mate. Oh. It's common manners for Pokemon trainers to battle when the rise mate. Alright, sure. Hello, yeah. Uh, you're challenged by youngster Jake. Hello, Jake. He's not a Scrobat. I hate Scrobat. Oh my god, he's so annoying. I hate a Scrobat. Oh my god, I hate Scrobat. Let's just use Ember. I'm gonna set all this fur on fire that way. Tackle. That's bad. Uh, let's go another Ember. Ember. Oof. Oh, so close. So close. So close. Let me use a quick attack. That'll do it. Nice. We killed a Scrover. We're going to have another Pokemon or something. Oh, there we go. Oh, no. We just have one Pokemon. All right. And I got some money for winning. Thanks for the money. I'll need that. Hmm. Uh... What's that thing? I've never seen that before. What's this? Trainer tips. Pokemon can gain... Oh, I was just talking about experience points. What's this? Two potions? What's this? Oh, what? How did I just dump, jump down? That's funny. Uh, that's another shooter thing, I think. Uh, oh, whoops. So then you press the home button. What's this? Three Pokeballs, nice. Let me jump down. Is that another trainer right there? Oh god. Wait, can I just go around? I think I can just go around. Oh, I made it around without looking into that person's eyes. Alright, one more trainer. Bring it on, bring it on, boy. I can be hot, but I'm gonna beat you. Oh uh, yeah, sure, kid. You're challenged by youngster Benjamin. Wait. Did you just change your name or something? Lip bug? What's that? Hmm. What type is that? Let me see. I think that's a bug type. So if we use Ember, that should probably be super effective. Yeah, that's super effective. It was a bug type. Yes. That's good. Oh, nick it. What's that? Uh, I'm actually gonna bring someone out. I'm gonna bring out my Z. I'm gonna bring out my Z dragon. Who? C dragon or Z dragon? Well. Uh, I don't know, this is hard. I'm gonna use Z Dragon. You know what? Anyway, what even is a Nicket? What's a Nicket? Eeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeee
So that's what it looks like. That is a little fox Pokemon. Uh, let's use Tackle. Quick Attack. Oh, that was quick. That's the speed of light. Oh no, that's not good. Come on, let's keep on using... Um, let's keep on using Tackle. Come on, Zigzagoon. Come on, Zigzagoon. Oh my god, this is not working out. Can I swap Pokemon or something? Yeah, I'm gonna swap out Seagull. I'm gonna swap out to Seagull and see what he's like. I'm gonna charge Seagull. Oh, he's cute. I mean, he has a big head. Sea Dragon and a small body. Uh, how about Water Gun? That'll work. Oh no. If my defense keeps on falling, that'll be bad. Nice, pretty good. How about Bite now? You Bite. Oh, hell with the gas. You're gonna make my defense keep on falling. I don't want that. Oh, God. Oh, wait, it's not very effective, it said. How about another water gun? Yep. Well, that was close! One more water gun, and Nick, it should be dead. Oh my gosh, my defense is gonna keep on falling! Quick attack again. Oh yeah, that did actually pretty good. I did about 6 damage. I can see why and how my defense fell. Oh, yeah. oh, and Dead Dragon just went up, and I learned a new, new lit. Congrats, lost to wild Pokemon, and lost to lost to many trainers. Cool, good for you. <laughs> no offense. I just hop over there, and I just mind my own business. Yeah, I'm just gonna sit down. Ah, oh, no, can you see them? Ah, oh, this is nice. You mind my own business. What's this hole in the water? How do I interact with it? I'm trying to press every single button. Oh, fishing. Oh, okay. So, when it shakes, then I have to press the A button to reel it in. Alright, what's this going to be? Oh, there we go. Is that a magic arc? Oh my god. I don't want a magic arc in this room. Oh, but Magikarp could evolve into Gyarados. Oh, but I, I'm not going to take it this time. Because Magikarp could... Because, like, Magikarp only has Splash, and, I get, and I'm not going to use that. Let's go see what Hop's up to. Look, there's a professor. What's that person? So, have you unraveled all the secrets of the Dynamax phenomenon yet? Oh, goodness, no. This whole thing is still full of questions. I'd hope that my granddaughter would take over research, but... Dear me, I'm sorry, I didn't even notice my guests. Hi. My name is... Magnolia? Magnolia? Welcome, young trainers, thanks. Now come, let's head indoors. What? Well, it's not freezing cold or something. Alright, sure. Let's just go in. But who is this Magnolia person? Why, Hobdy, I see really has made some new friends. And you must be Akitas. I trust you received the Pokedex from Sonia. I'm sure you'll have it complete in no time. No time? You're kidding me. It takes ages to complete the Pokedex. You must already know about Dynamaxing, right, Akitas? Uh, no. Professor Magnolia has been... Oh, no, that's Leon, sorry. Professor Magnolia has been research into... Been doing research into the Dynamax phenomenon for years and years. Great. And it takes a proper understanding of the thing if you plan to use Dynamaxing to the fullest. Dave, there you go again, Leon. Always talking about Pokemon. There are other things that are worth knowing about too, you know? Like how many different types of tea there are. <laughs> <laughs> hey, 
Hey, Professor. Hey, Professor. Do us a favor, would you? Help me convince Lee he should endorse us for the gym challenge. Oh, Liam, why wouldn't you endorse them? Hop and Akita's only just started out as Pokemon trainers. What do you mean? I've got like three Pokemon already. It's pretty good. There's still loads they don't know yet. I know about evolving. I know about Pokemon. I know about the Pokedex. I know about uh, nothing else. Deary, I thought your dream was to have everyone in the galleries and become strong trainers, isn't that right? Well, yeah, you're not wrong. That girl's precisely the reason I gave them both Pokemon in fact. Has Hop been doing that for ages? Right then, in that case, how about this? Let's see if the two of you can show me such a brilliant battle that I'm left with no choice but to endorse you. Yay, do that right now. Let's do it in the kitchen. Let's have a battle in the kitchen. <laughs> and, and don't worry, I'll make sure both of your teens are in good shape before the battle starts. What does that mean? What? What does that sound? Right, I'll be waiting outside of Cutus. Okay, cool. Right then. We're gonna go out and then we're gonna have the battle and finish this episode. Is there anything this way? It's, I feel like there is something this way. Yep, there is something this way. A Pokeball, what is it? A great ball? New, no, a high gear performance Pokeball that provides the highest success cap rate for catching Pokemon than standard than the standard level Pokeball. Well that's pretty cool. Just found the thing that I was. So yeah. Hurry it up, Akita, so I'm really trying. You've got to battle me so I can get myself that endorsement. Alright, I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. Jeez, jeez. Let's go then. I'm going to become the greatest Pokemon trainer there is. And to do that, I need that endorsement to take part in the gym challenge. Come at me with everything you have so we can prove to Lee that we've got what it takes. Of course, let's go then. Right. Oh, Magnolia's coming. I'm rather interested in seeing how you two young trainers ba battle too. Thanks. Listen, you two, the reason I'm unbeatable is because I learn from every battle I see or take part in. That's how I've gotten to where I am today, to show me something in this battle. Let's go then. It's time for my legend to begin. Let's go then. Who's it going to send out first? Let's go. Right, first up is really alright. I've battled really many times before. So yeah, let's take them on. Have you gotten a bit stronger? Me and my team will put you to the test. Yeah, I'm strong enough. An ember, let's go, ember. Sorry. Ooh, not bad. Tackle. That only did about 4 HP. So yeah, you got to learn a bit more, huh? Ooh, close! Yeah, attack is not going to do, because you're going to die. One more quick attack. Yep. Yeah. That's really dead. Nice. Woo. And Sea Dragon leveled up. That's pretty cool. He's about to send out his brookies. So yeah, I'm just gonna keep my score button. Oh not bad, his group is about level eight. Right, and there's gonna be super effective, so let's use that. Nice, one more of those and then he'll be dead. Well look at you, seems you've really learned in time matchups. Yeah, I have before actually. Scratch, not bad, that's about five. Whew, well, let's go. Grookey is now dead, that's super effective. And I think that's all the Pokemon out, basically. Oh, both S-Dragon and Z-Dragon in the back. Wait, he wants to learn a new move. Double kick. Yeah, let's forget an old move. What type is that? That's a fighting type. I'm gonna forget that. I'm gonna forget tackle. Uh, I'm gonna miss tackle. It's my first ever move. And basically, also go. 
Oh, he's got a rickety. Uh, actually, no, I'm gonna stick with S Gray. It'll be a close one, but that's exactly my sort of match. And that rickety then, and we're gonna beat him. Hmm. What is on earth? Oh, I wonder what that is. Hmm. Oh, double kick's not very effective. Oh, is Rookie a um, flying type? And if and um, fighting types are not very effective against flying types, so I'm just going to use an Ember right now. Okay. Oh, that was good. One more. Oh, Peck. Not bad. That's what I like to see from Hot. But, sorry, Hot. You're down. That was fun though. And not much XP for whatever. Yep, that's all this Pokemon. Ooh, that's it that I lost. But I'd expect nothing left from my rifle. Thanks. And lots of money for winning. And I even got my Pokeball for a perfect too. The sting of defeat and the joy of victory. I guess going through both is the key to the two of us getting stronger, right? Yep, so right. Well, we won that. He's like, wow. The key to top, but I've seen a match like that one. I suppose I have little choice but to give you both an endorsement as champion. Thanks. I don't give one to top, give one to me, because I won. Yay. Letter of endorsement. A letter of recommendation that you'll need in order to pass it. Participate in the gym challenge. Yes, thanks, Lee. I swear I'm gonna win my way through the gym challenge to reach you. Okay, then swear, because I'm gonna. Alright, so when I beat Leon, I'm gonna make Hot swear. <laughs> <laughs> you may both be young still and plenty rough around the edges, but it was a proper battle. Charles and I were both feeling the excitement in every last cell in our bodies. Pop, you've always tended to get caught up in things like how you throw your Pokeball out. Things that have nothing to do with real strength. Honestly, I've been worried about you still obsessing over that sort of nonsense. But it seems you really have grown a bit, little brother. And I'd, and I'd like to see some more thrilling Pokemon battles out of you too, Akitas. Alright Kitas, you and me are going to train up against one another to aim for that champion's title. Absolutely! The more we keep battling against one another, the more our Pokemon will grow. Huh? What's that? What? I don't see anything. Oh look! It's a wishing. It's a um... Uh, I can't remember what it's called. What is that? What's that? Kitas, would you like this? The wishing stars. Since there are two of them, you should take the one yourself. The wishing star? No. A stone found in the gallery room with a mysterious pet said that your dreams come true if you find one. With one of these, my Pokemon can dynamax. Yes, they're going to be massive. Yes. Trust, trust you to pull something like this. They say wishing stars fall down for those who have a true wish in their heart, you know. I will be the greatest trainer ever. I will be the greatest trainer ever. I will be the greatest trainer ever. Yeah, I've said it three times, so surely my wish will come true now, right? Don't be silly, Hot. Those wishing stars are composed of a curious sort of rock containing unknown power. They are one of the most precious resources we have here in the Galar region, but they won't do a thing in that state. Give them to me and I'll have them sorted. All oh, right, you've done heaps of research on the Dynamax phenomenon, haven't you, Professor? Then please give Akitas and me the power to Dynamax our Pokemon. First, we got to battle against our mad Pokemon in the slumbering world, and now this. It really feels like we're getting caught up in the adventure of a lifetime. I do understand your, your excitement, young man, but don't get carried away. You want to save energy for tomorrow's journey. All right. Oh, that's only. Seems I came back home right in time for all the excitement. Hey, you lot, why not have some dinner? You must be hungry, right? I've totally been obsessed with making the, less, the latest trendy curries. Nice. 
that's cool. Cool, is it the next day or something? Yep, it is. It's morning at last and time for our adventure to truly start. Good morning to you, young challengers. Pop, has it truly really met some Pokemon you don't recognise? Is there anything more you can tell me about it? Uh, well, there was weird fo heavy fog and then this even weird Pokemon appeared. Kids tried to fight it off, but then we both passed out or something. It's all pretty hazy. A writer found of information you are. Icky to top these are for you. Thanks. What is it? What is it? What's that band? A Dynamax band? Cool. Nice. Do we use that Dynamax? Yeah, I get that it's a Dynamax thing, whatever it is. I'm gonna skip talking to you so I can just get ahead on Dynamax. Yes, 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 I get that, I get that, I get that. Oh, we're going to a station now. All right, guys, so that's it for this video. Hopefully you enjoyed. Smash, smash that like button, turn on notifications and never miss a video to never miss a video and subscribe and I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.